Right, so I've got a little explaining to do after oh the sideburns today are not behaving. Um so basically, um why am I doing this thing that I walk around the room like my dad does when I'm booking? We sit down. Okay, so after the we went to Brixton Splash, yeah, it was there was nothing on. But anyway, so we were gonna go out and we didn't go out. Just ended up coming to mine with loads of people and just chilling, which is fine, but I feel like I didn't explain why there was no footage after that. Yeah, we we had fun. Not in that way, but we chilled. Um, and then yesterday I started moving back home because my halls are finishing, well, in about a month, but I don't really want to be there by myself because loads of people aren't there anymore. So yeah, um, that's kind of what I started like bringing all my clothes home. So that's where I am now. Um, but yes, today I just basically woke up. <laughs> I have two days off from work, so I'm just chilling, not really doing much. And I think we're going to go see the Amy film later. So that should be good. Um, but yeah. Let's hope that I think that'll be good for me. Oh yeah, I, jo I joined up in the, for the gym for a month here, so I'm gonna go do that later. I wonder if I can take my camera, and that'd be quite interesting. Me sweating, not like I don't sweat. Anyway, I'm rambling. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'm gonna go do that. Joined up, and I think I'm gonna go for a swim. <laughs> just got back from seeing um, Amy and it was quite a trauma traumatic experience in a good way though not in a bad way well mum's kind of exhausted yeah yeah I'm it was more the fact that I feel like throughout the film you got to know her and then it was like her life basically from the beginning and then by the end you felt like you were losing like a friend but it was more so for me and mum because she is from around like where we from exactly. where we from and I guess you can identify with parts of what she went through yeah and then seeing how extreme she takes what other people might have gone through to those extremes yeah but mm. seeing how beautiful she was so beautiful mm -hmm. and so likeable her character was just so it just drew you to her, didn't it? Yeah. So it was just really like I, I just wasn't. I knew it was going to be good because loads of people told me it was going to be good, but I didn't expect it to be that captivating. And I think it was like three hours long, but I, you know, it goes really quickly. Um, but yeah, it was a really, really good documentary. That's probably the best one I've seen actually in terms of someone's life. They really back. They got loads of clips from. Like it's probably a bit of a spoiler, by the way. But <laughs> they go just have you have to go see it. I can't really say much more without spoiling it. But yeah, go see it. Definitely a really good powerful, one. Powerful, really powerful. Very powerful. We enjoyed it. <laughs> I'm not sure about enjoyed, but no, I enjoyed um, it because I, I appreciate really you filming. Moved, moved maybe yeah. is the word. But we're definitely gonna have a hopefully a nice sleep now. <laughs> Um, excuse my horrible face, which a lot of makeup's come off now. But yeah, um, tomorrow, well, I'll tell you tomorrow when I start filming tomorrow. I'm going to go to bed now.